dog. She just needs a little time to warm up to somebody. She's a little tentative at first, but uh, you know, once she when she knows you, she's your best friend. Um, she you know, has been here a little while. I think she uh, she's definitely looking to get out and get in that forever. <coughs> adopted once before. Uh, she had to be returned. Um, largely not to her own fault. She just, the owner was moving and, you know, had to give her up, unfortunately. So now she's here and she needs to, her next home needs to be her last. Do great with an active family. Someone who has a little bit of patience to let her get used to them. Uh, when, but like I said, once she warms up, um, she's going to be your best friend. She's ex once she gets to know you, she's extremely loyal and playful. All right, so this is Sheba. Sheba is affectionate, fun-loving girl. She loves belly rubs. She loves to give kisses. Um, she's really overall sweet girl. She would be very loyal to you. She would sit by your side on cold nights and keep you warm. Lots of kisses, lots of love. Lots of fun. She loves to play ball. I think Sheba would do best with a, an active family. Um, older children. Um, lots of exercise, lots of long walks. A uh, big yard to play ball in. She was super affectionate. Uh, once she gets to know you, she's very loving. She sits next to you. I think she would definitely be a bit snuggly. Okay. She'd probably hog all the blankets. So this is Sheba. Um, she's one of our our sweet dogs that we have here at the Little Shelter. Um, she is probably one of my favorite dogs we have. Uh, for several reasons. Um, I really appreciate that she's a, a dog who really bonds with you when she trusts you. Um, I have a dog very similar to that at my house and um, she exhibits very similar qualities that he has. So I really appreciate that with her. Um, it's really rewarding to see that when a dog finally trusts you and is comfortable with you that they really open up and basically show you exactly who they are. Um, that's probably one of the most rewarding things about my job and being able to work with dogs like Sheba um, here at the shelter. Being able to help them open up, um, help them find homes, and really get comfortable, you know? Show their true qualities. A lot of these guys often end up misunderstood. Um, and really it just takes, a, just takes someone who is willing to give them the time that they need to really um, work with them and, and make sure that they're that they know that they're in the right place and that they're gonna be taken care of, basically. I would say she's very playful. Um, I've seen a lot of people actually have some really good play times with her. Throwing the ball, um, playing with squeaky toys. I don't know how she is with Frisbee. She might be good, she might not be. I'm not really sure, I haven't tried it myself, but uh, that would be something I would try with her at some point. Um, I would also say that, you know, um, she's very good and responsive on the leash when she really trusts and knows you. Um, she is definitely one when you correct her and tell her uh, to kind of slow it down if she's going too quickly, she responds very nicely and um, will take notice right away, you know. She knows her boundaries and she respects them. Sheba, I know, belly rubs, belly rubs. She loves belly rubs. Oh. <laughs> wow. 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 She'll lay here for hours and let you do this.